It's the big dubs here, Winston. And it's reviews with booze. And I'm scoping out Flying Daggers by White Wizard. This album is a prime example of endurance. You see, you need to fucking sometimes when you buy an album, sit down and make sure you listen to the whole damned album. Because the first six songs on here, the food, the food, <laughs> forgive my crackage, the first six songs on here are a little just unexciting to me. You know, and it, I think it's also the topics for me, you know, West LA Nights, I can give two fucking shits about what happens in West LA Nights. Even though, you know, the rainbows, and that's kind of cool, it's catchy. But anyways, the first six songs are just kind of whatever, not that great. But they're not bad, they're not Creed, they're not fucking, ah! But they're not this beer, I don't like this. I don't like this. Shock Top, I know a lot of you hipsters will be like, oh, boo this man, but fuck that. Not into this, this shit blows. But I'll drink it anyway. Kind of like the first six songs. Didn't blow as bad as this beer, though. <laughs> but anyways, when you hit song seven, you kind of get into a secret little conceptual group of songs on this album that are actually kind of cool all together. And uh, I really enjoy that part. The songwriting almost just seems different. All of a sudden, it's like these normal three-minute songs that are just, and there's like a ballad in there, blah, blah, blah. But then all of a sudden, it's like, whoa. Epic conceptual material out of nowhere. Wow, that's cool. See, I never really heard these guys before. But I saw something on the tubage and dude was fucking well in live on a bootleg video with the voice and I was like, damn, that motherfucker's pretty good. What the fuck is that? Oh, snap. Somebody was smoking in here. Anyways. <laughs> Sorry about that. I checked it out, and like I, it has a cool concept at the end, it has to do with extraterrestrials and stuff, and what I love about albums is when the, the most epic song is the final one, so you really feel like the finale is the finale, and I feel that's how this album kind of went. Overall, I'd say it's good. I'm, I'll give it a, out of a six pack, I'd say three and a half, and definitely worth giving a check. Scope it out if y'all want. Shark Top kind of blows. It's reviews of booze. What do I gotta lose? This episode was a snooze.